Hey guys, back out in the bush for this trip, doing a solo hiking camp. It's gonna be a good time. I am hiking along the inland pack track, heading to the ballroom overhang. It's not a particularly long hike, but it's supposed to be a really awesome spot to camp. So, yeah, I wanted to check it out, and we got some beautiful weather today. A couple of river crossings along the way. And yeah, it's just, it's gonna be good. All right, so we've got our first river crossing here. Up there, right there, is where I need to go. That's an orange triangle. So we gotta get in here and go up there. Good thing I brought spare socks. It's a bit chilly though, I, it's not too bad, but the longer I'm in it, the colder my legs are getting. Damn hook grass. Almost there. That's where we're going.
woods deep. That crossing there is supposed to take five minutes. I think it took a bit longer with all the filming. All these limestone formations are absolutely stunning. It's really slowing me down. I keep wanting to stop and take them in and yeah. Really cool, it's some beautiful scenery. Got another river crossing coming up right, right ahead. You would not want to be in this area when it's raining because these rivers would be lethal. Some of them were already up to my mid thigh. And yeah, you wouldn't really want to go much higher. Last river crossing till we're there. This is epic. This is cool. Holy smokes. Nice fire pit, a couple of bench benches. I'll be using that tonight because it's gonna get chilly. But might. My lens isn't wide enough to capture the whole thing, but this is epic. <whistles> Got about an hour left of light. It's gonna get pretty chilly in here. The forest, the bush around us is real damp because um, it drips from all around the cliff here and plus we're in a gully, so with the river. So yeah, it's gonna get pretty chilly in here tonight, but I, my fingers are getting real cold. My body doesn't feel that bad. I did put my thermal on, but I was losing dexterity in my fingers. So I just ran around and tried to scrounge up a bit of firewood. There's not a lot around here. I've managed to find some, um, but I wanna get this tent set up and then I'm gonna see if I can get some more firewood. But that's the plan, let's go. This place is flipping awesome. Love it. Lots of little. No messing around tonight. Lighter and some fire starter.
All right, this fire is really struggling a bit. I'm gonna try to split some wood down. More a companion. Nice light knife for hiking. You can still baton with it as well. Fire's going good now. Before I get these boots off, I think I'm just gonna finish setting up my sleeping gear. So, yeah, it's just the normal stuff, sleeping bag, sleeping bag liner, and uh, thin wrist. All stuff sacks go inside one, so I know where they all are. I did bring spare socks, but I'm not going to change them until I get in bed because I'm going to have to put my feet back in these boots and that. For dinner, we've got Uncle Ben's Mexican style rice and some. Garlic naan bread. Easy and simple for tonight. So we're just going to throw a tiny bit of water in here. Just chuck the rice in the pot. Okay, that looks appetizing. So I've just got the rice off to the side with the lid on, staying warm. Now we've got to sort out the naan bread. Alright, let's give this a go. I'm just going to throw it on there real, real briefly. Basically just to try and warm it up. Anyway, got my rice, got my naan bread. And yeah, just a real easy dinner for tonight. Cheers guys. Mm. I try to avoid buying single serve packets and stuff like that. But sometimes it's just more practical. And um, yeah, this is actually going down really well. So I'll just show you real quick how I'm feeding the fire. So we've got one big log here, another one there. All I'm doing is feeding them in, pushing them in, bit by bit as they burn. I just put some water on the boil just to clean my pot. Makes it easier to get all the gunk off. Basically a staple of mine now while I'm out camping. I'm gonna make some popcorn. Popcorn's all done. Cheers. Mmm. Can't go wrong. It's 
time to get these boots off. Well guys, in my sleeping bag for the night. Gonna snuggle down, warm up my toes and go to bed. If anything happens in the night, I'll let you know, but otherwise I'll see you in the morning. Cheers. Morning. Wasn't as cold as I thought it was going to be last night, but a bit chilly, not too bad. I was nice and warm in my sleeping gear, so that's all that matters. Ugh. Having trouble waking up this morning, anyway. It's time to get up. It's a bit cloudy today. So I've got oats for breakfast, and what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna got my canteen here full of water, and I'm just gonna place it in the fire. That way, and bo I'll boil this water. That way I can put my oats in my cup, and then pour in bit by bit the amount of water I want so I get the best consistency that I want. That's the plan. Now I started doing this on my four day hike in Richmond Forest Park and that is, I also dump my coffee sachet in with the oats and it just adds a nice flavour it means I don't have to make a separate drink
Okay, so the wood is boiled. One side problem, I seem to have misplaced my spoon. I can't find it. Oh, it's here, don't worry, I found it. Cheers, guys. All packed up now guys sun's come out and it's beautiful blue skies again no more clouds which is quite nice but yeah this is a wicked place it's a great great spot to camp I'd love to come here with a group of friends or something and hang out if I ever come back here again I'd definitely pack in some firewood it's not a huge hike in there's just a load of river crossings but apart from that it's actually a pretty gentle hike there's no major ups or downs you just need to be careful with the river crossings but um yeah so i definitely think it'd be worth packing in some wood because there's not a whole lot around here and all the forest is really wet but apart from that it's a great location I left a couple of big logs here for whoever comes here next so at least i'll have some firewood but yeah it's been a really nice relaxing camp Anyway, it's time to get going. All right, it's time to go. We're heading out. One last final look at the overhang. I've already rolled up my pants because we've got this river crossing straight off the straight off the bat here.
Alright guys, I'm going to end it here. I've got a bunch more river crossings to do. It's a beautiful day. I had an awesome time in an awesome location. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you in the next one. Cheers. Thank you for watching.